Good afternoon. It took 16 minutes into the convention last night before Milwaukee was even mentioned. The political focus shifts back here today. Team coverage of a big political day in the cream city. Amy DuPont is on the president's son campaigning in Milwaukee during the convention. Our Aaron Maben looking at the state's role in the DNC. But let's start today with political reporter Jason Calvey. He is live with the latest on today's activities. Hey, Jason. Hey, yeah, the theme tonight is leadership matters. So we'll hear from former presidents Jimmy Carter and Bill Clinton. There will be a number of things happening right here in Milwaukee. But it's not good. Milwaukee Mayor Tom Barrett will gavel in the session. But I have thought about not giving the gavel up and just talking for three hours about how great Milwaukee is. But I might meet the Sergeant of Arms, who happens to be Congresswoman Moore, who would uh, escort me away if I did that. Wisconsin, you have 96 votes. Then the roll call vote. We cast 47 votes for the next But it won't look like the past. States. It will include live and taped speeches. Hillary. We're going to hear from people. Uh, we're going to hear from those small business owners, those parents, those teachers who are going to share their story about the chaos and crisis of Donald Trump and talk about Joe Biden's vision for America. It'll be led from Milwaukee by county resident Jason Ray, secretary of the DNC, who's been going to conventions since he was 17. I'm honestly just humbled. And Lieutenant Governor Mandela Barnes. I'll be giving a little chit chat. Will announce the votes for Wisconsin. And I am so excited to have the opportunity to deliver our delegate votes to the next president of the United States, Joe Biden. Uh, right now, Americans understand that we need leadership. Delegates already voted on the platform with hundreds of Bernie Sanders delegates voting no. The party platform is an aspirational statement about what we care about, what we believe in, what we intend to champion, and the fact that they could not bring themselves simply to say that health care should be a human right is problematic for me. But the senator urged his supporters to back Biden. And it is the most aggressive agenda in Democratic Party platform history. Now, Senator Sanders last night did praise Joe Biden for wanting to expand health care. You may remember back in 2016, Sanders supporters heckled, they booed, they even staged a walkout. But none of that's possible now that we're in the age of this virtual convention. Reporting live at the Wisconsin Center, Jason Calvey, Fox 6 News. Yeah, good point there. All right, Jason, thank you. And here are some of the big speakers for tonight. They include former President Jimmy Carter, former President Bill Clinton will address the convention, former Senator and U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry will also speak, and former Second Lady and Joe Biden's wife, Jill Biden, will wrap up the evening.